In the shower, I get a hug from the universe. He comes and brings the gift, brilliant presence with gratitude in the mix, ignoring demons, obstacles, they run for cover. She too, my love, forever always caring, daringly, brings all what I am and I am all, surrounded by messengers of grace. Some forget that I had never heard the story of God, the story of love, the story of divinity, pain, my middle name, now I redo my reality. Let love ideas penetrate. Lecture at Imergo, coming up for air, tapping the walls of the universe. Behold, there are no walls. The light is much to tolerate, so hard to sleep, so much to do, so much to think and feel. Research, write, discover, the turning has no time. We are overdue. I will fly. Here comes the phone book. Mes éclats de corps dans le lit. Chercher un endroit pour me reposer, je suis en mars. Je pousse mon pied profond dans le matelas. Sentir ma force me distraire de ce désir. L'air froid flotte dedans. J'ouvre plus, tout simplement, parce que ton désir m'offre le reste ultime du abandon. My body slivers in the bed looking for a place to rest. I'm on the move. I push my foot deep in the mattress, feel my strength, distract myself from such desire. Cool air floats in. I open more simply because your desire offers me the ultimate rest of surrender. Can I do the uh, version here? Oh, yeah. Oh, yeah? Okay. In English. In English, okay. Or are you telling? No, English. Okay. There you go. It's called Fred. <laughs> my body painfully frozen, my mouth between my legs, love that lost the fight, decades of history surfacing shades of me. I'm dismissed. Vagina numb, I think. My bed messy for no good reason. I touch myself, but no one home. A cop car, people howling below my window. Damn, there's reality. The mantra, tantra in my mind. You are the love, the light. But something broke back there. Suddenly, a fly lands on my thigh. My inner thigh, the tender side. Immediately, I call him Fred. Ridiculous. Fred, tiptoes, carefully alert. He tickles me. My hand about to swipe him off, but, but no. I let him touch me, crawl on me, caress me featherly light. As he so slowly works his way to where it really matters. Fred stops magnificently, intimidated by the forest. He really does not want to enter, but sits on top. He tests. My fantasies run wild. Ever so careful, I spread my legs. For Fred, not that he cares. He tiptoes around, almost falls in. He tickles me carefully, lowering himself. I shiver. A sense of warmth begins to flood my body, so unexpectedly revived. I realize the door has opened. I am saved by Fred or me or God, who knows who. I make a promise to myself, until the day I die, I will never swap a fly. <laughs> 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 